Uh, being a National Teaching Fellow has meant an awful lot to me because I work in a central department and I work with lots of staff over all different disciplines. And throughout my career, um, I'm really passionate about inclusivity and particularly how technology could be used creatively to affect student uh, information and, and experiences. So I've been working with people and I've had fantastic comments from people all over the university congratulating me and saying it's great I've been recognised for the work I've been doing. I think the National Teaching Fellowship Scheme is really important because it allows people from vastly different backgrounds to be recognised for the academic practice that they do. Very often it's, it's what you do normally and so to have it written down that actually what you do is recognised, rewarded and respected by your peers. And I think that peer support and that peer uh, recognition is really really important and it's about something that you take for granted it's what you do so to actually for somebody to say what you do is is different is excellent and is really makes a difference that's the important bit of it Well, what I'm planning to do with my Teaching Fellowship um, Award is two things, really. One of them is going to be looking at how um, I can get more staff to use video in uh, the virtual learning environment. But I want to make it a sort of just-in-time video. But also, how can we subtitle it and how can we make it more inclusive so for international students, uh, students who need the subtitles? Um, I met with a company, and when I was talking to them about this, they also introduced me to a new piece of software, which is a uh, way you can can actually um, audio record your own academic practice and get it analysed to see um, how you uh, develop things like um, cri uh, uh, critical evaluation. So I'm also interested in how we could use something like that as reflective practitioners to reflect on our own practice. <laughs>